The city of Atlanta is seeing a sharp rise in deadly domestic violence cases, and the city's police chief says he is discouraged. The uptick in numbers represents roughly 30% of the city's homicides this year. 11 Alive's Grace King explains what the department is seeing. Escalating disputes has always been the number one motivator for a homicide in our city. Uh, that has changed in the first quarter of this year. Atlanta Police Chief Darren Sherbaum noting a sharp rise in one category of homicides. We are now seeing domestic violence occurrences, individuals that are harmed by individuals they are in a relationship with or related to or live in the same locality, the same house or the same apartment. His officers have responded to 12 domestic violence related homicides so far in 2024, up significantly from just two at this point last year. We cannot be in living rooms and homes uh, to, to be able to keep the peace. Experts say it's impossible to pinpoint a single reason behind the drastic rise in deadly domestic violence incidents because it's likely a combination of factors. There is very little, if any, safe, affordable housing in the United States at all. Jan Christensen, executive director of the Georgia Coalition Against Domestic Violence, says many people experiencing domestic violence can feel trapped by a lack of options. Sometimes it's a choice, right, of staying with the devil you know, um, something you can usually predict, you can perhaps placate, or the devil you don't, moving into perhaps an unsafe area with your children, changing your children's schools. She says finances, firearms, and the stigma surrounding domestic violence can be a lethal combination. If society doesn't begin to talk about it, it's, it's, not, it's never gonna go away. In Atlanta, Grace King, 11 Alive News.